State Senator and Republican candidate for Governor Darren Bailey facing backlash for comments he made in 2017 while running for state representative. In a Facebook post then, Bailey called abortion an atrocity and then compared it to the Holocaust. The uh, attempted extermination of the Jews of World War II, it doesn't even compare on a shadow of, of the life that has been lost and, and with abortion since its legalization. Those comments drawing sharp criticism from pro-choice and Jewish groups. You take that murder of six million people and you want to compare that to something like a person's right to make self-determination about their own body, about their own rights, it is so heinous. It is so disgusting. My great-grandparents were killed in the Holocaust. It's something intensely personal to me and my family. And to have somebody so cavalierly use the idea and the concept of genocide in context for political points, is it, it's so unfathomable to me. Tonight, Bailey issuing a statement clarifying what he said. The Holocaust is a human tragedy without parallel. In no way was I attempting to diminish the atrocities of the Holocaust and its stain on history. I meant to emphasize the tragedy of millions of babies being lost. A Pritzker campaign spokeswoman called Bailey's 2017 comments unconscionable and disqualifying. Planned Parenthood called for an apology. The executive director for Illinois Right to Life said Bailey's comments are being taken out of context. Planned Parenthood, as well as the Pritzker campaign, are using this to deflect what the real issue is. The fact that Illinois' abortion laws are radical and even too radical for many who identify as pro-choice. Bailey has always been staunchly against abortion, so that issue will continue to be a part of this campaign. What is unclear is whether his Holocaust comments will cost him any votes. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.